I got seven kids and seven baby mamas. Now for the past few days, I've been going live, telling my story, speaking my truth. And a lot of women having an issue calling me a deadbeat. Yeah, I could have pulled out, but I didn't. And I ain't care to pull out because- Young living every day, giving it to you and cutting straight. Now listen, if it's your first time watching my video and you have not yet subscribed to my channel, take a second, scroll down, click on the subscribe button, subscribe to the channel support the movement i appreciate that y'all moving forward man today's topic man is about a man who went viral man let's dive into it i got seven kids and seven baby mamas now for the past few days i've been going live telling my story speaking my truth and a lot of women having an issue calling me a deadbeat because i tell them i was being irresponsible yet not wearing protection but i always tell uh, these women that i got pregnant that i do not want to be a father to these children and i offer to pay for the abortion majority of times they'll either take the abortion or they'll take a plan b but only these seven have kept these children but the crazy thing about it is they want me to be responsible for some children i told them i did not want so for some years now some of them been trying to get in contact with me access denied because I, I don't really know why you're trying to get in contact with me i didn't told you i did not want them kids so don't expect me to be responsible financially, emotional, spiritually, mentally, or physically with some kids I do not want. And I don't give a fuck what nobody think about it. You're not going to force children up on me. Yeah, we both made the decision to lay down and have intercourse. We both was irresponsible about the decisions we made that night. Yeah, I could have pulled out, but I didn't. And I ain't care to pull out because I'm not the one that's gonna have to carry a baby for nine months. It's the woman. In my opinion, women should be more careful on who they sleep with. Because you're gonna be like, one of my baby mamas trying to find me so I can financially support a kid I didn't told her or them I did not want. Another thing is, these just jump offs. These are the type of women that I ain't even had to do nothing for. The bare minimum, but they gave me access to their body and they think I wanna be a, <coughs> a father to a child for one of them? Wait, I don't even have no type of love for these women. How do they expect me to love these children? Before y'all say, oh, he irresponsible, he a deadbeat, he don't take accountability. Yeah, I do. I just don't give a fuck. You ain't gonna force these children on me when I told you I ain't want them. Yeah, I can offer to a pay for abortion, but at what point can I force a woman to go get an abortion? I cannot. A woman say, my body, my choice, but I say, it's my life, my choice. Before y'all try to stitch this shit and be like, black man this, black man that, I don't give a fuck. I really don't. I'm gonna play that back one time, and then I'm gonna start speaking on it. I got seven kids and seven baby mamas. Now, for the past few days, I've been going live, telling my story, speaking my truth. And a lot of women having an issue calling me a deadbeat because I tell them I was being irresponsible, yet not wearing protection. But I always tell uh, these women that I got pregnant that I do not want to be a father to these children. See what I'm saying? I would always tell these women, you hear what he said? I would always tell these women, I do not want to be a father to those children. So not only you lay down with a Tyrone, because clearly you can look at this guy and tell. He's a clearly tall guy, right? He's probably easy on the eye to mass majority of women in, you know, in that community. After dealing with so many women, clearly he probably knows how to get inside, you know, sell the dream, whatever the case might be. So he's going to get an abundance of options because he, you know, he hit the genetic lottery, you know, being tall and, you know, be able to navigate around women. All right, cool. Now. You got a guy who do not care, right? And he tell you he don't care. Let's say he, let's hypothetically say this man tell these women he don't care about none of that stuff. I don't want to have no kids. You lay down and then you still have unprotected sex with this guy and let him bust in you. I'm holding the woman accountable for that. It's the woman's fault. There's a lot of good guys out there who want to have families, right? Who want to build with these women. These women ignore mass majority 80 90 percent of men who want them and they chase after guys with that mentality right there but he letting you know off top i don't like you like that i don't want to have a family with you and then you still ignore the guys who want to be with you and go 
deal with a guy like this who have no intentions of building anything with you. That's a personal issue on a female. But let's continue. And I offer to pay for the abortion. Majority of times they'll either take the abortion or they'll take a plan B. But only these seven have kept these children. But the crazy thing about it is they want me to be responsible for some children I told them I did not want. So for some years now, some of them been trying to get in contact with me, access denied. Because I, I don't really know why you're trying to get in contact with me. I didn't told you I did not want them kids. So don't expect me to be responsible financially, emotional, spiritually, mentally, or physically with some kids I do not want. That's the truth. Now, I agree that men should take care of their children. But you lay down and make a baby with a guy who don't want to have a family with you. Then you have the kid anyway, and you think that's going to change his mind. No, he told you what it was in the beginning. He's not going to contribute financially, emotionally. In, in no way. He said that already. But you still do it anyway. It's the lady's fault. Now you got to be a single mom because of how you felt, your desires and won't. Oh, see, this is the, like I said already, this is the problem. All these women want the same guy. You, you get the luxury of having the guy to tell you he don't want the children. Or he give you the money to get the abortion and you still keep the kid. It's on you. This to all the women watching. This, this is this is the kind of guys to be out here. Any woman watching my channel, these are the kind of men to be out here. He letting you know what time it is. And the crazy part about it is, even after this going viral on TikTok, guess what? The sad part is, it's still going to be multiple women lining up who don't have no kids allowing this man to sleep with them and busting them willing to become single moms after hearing what he said because he got status we know status is the number one currency in america but let's continue and i don't give a fuck what nobody think about it you're not going to force children up on me yeah we both made the decision to lay down and have intercourse we both was irresponsible about the decisions we made that night yeah i could have pulled out but i didn't and I ain't care to pull out because I'm not the one that's going to have to carry a baby for nine months. That's the truth. That is the, that is the truth. Women are the primary guardian of the child. Like he said, I should have pulled out, but I didn't and I don't care. This is clearly a Tyrone right here. He don't care. Let's continue. It's the woman. In my opinion, women should be more careful on who they sleep with. Because you're going to be like one of my baby mamas trying to find me so I can financially support a kid I didn't told her or them I did not want. He letting you know out of all his baby mamas who looking for him, trying to search for him, and he ain't trying to get in contact with him. If you come my way, you're going to be a victim just like the rest of them. At the end of the day, right, I'm, I don't agree with doing that. But at the end of the day, the guy keeping it real, he letting you know, I don't want you. I'm not going to take care of the kid. But like I said already, yeah, it's still going to be loads of women. Now he got status because we know status is the number one currency. They're going to be lining up, ready to lay down, make a baby with this guy because most girls think they special and that they're going to change him. If seven baby mamas later and the other women he said who he uh, had get abortions who actually went through with it, if they couldn't change him, you ain't going to be able to change him. That's, I think that's the problem too. A lot of girls think that they can change a guy. They think they're so special and that if he deal with me, he going to be different. No, you're not. No, you're not. It's, it, there's no tricks that you have sexually. No, no, nothing that you can do to him that he ain't already experienced. But let's continue. Another thing is these just jump offs. These are the type of women that I ain't even had to do nothing for. The bad minimum, but they gave me access to their body. And they think I want to be a, a father to a child for one of them. Wait. And that's what I tell you guys. Look what he said. I did the bare minimum for Tyrone. All you guys going out here chasing after these girls, texting her all the time, good morning, trying to take her on all these expensive dates. And guess what? You got men like that while you sitting, while your phone, your text and her phone sitting on red. Guess what? She getting her sugar walls tapped and bust in by him. He tapping her sugar walls, activating the waterfalls. And guess what he's doing? The quarterback withdrawal telling her, hell no. This is a prime example of why I tell you, man, do not deal with women who don't show you a high level of interest. 
because if you're not getting a high level of interest guess what's gonna happen you're gonna be chasing after her and she's gonna be getting her soul dug out of her chest by tyrone dudes like this i don't even have no type of love for these women how do they expect me to love these children before y'all say oh he irresponsible he a deadbeat he don't take accountability yeah i do i just don't give a fuck you ain't gonna force these children on me when i told you i ain't want them yeah I can offer to a pay for abortion, but at what point can I force a woman to go get an abortion? I cannot. That's true. Definitely can pay for it, but you can't force them. But like I said, I think they just be trying to keep it to try to change a dude and think that if he keep the baby, he gonna, that's going to keep him around. It's not. It's not going to work. But let's continue. A woman say my body, my choice, but I say it's my life my choice before y'all try to stitch this shit and be like black man this black man that i don't give a fuck i really don't he said like and it's the truth women say my body my choice guess what it's his life is his choice that is 100 true do i agree with the method no but what he's saying is very true feels and reels are two different things doesn't matter how i feel about the situation what he said is the truth that's the reality you know and like i said man before i get out of here y'all i just want to let y'all know man to any woman out there man marry before you carry now ain't no guarantee but it will do is mitigate risk it'll weed out a lot of guys who just want to get in there and ejaculate and evacuate clearly this is a guy that don't want you and i think this is the problem that a lot of women have because they always go after guys who do not want them that's going to be a huge uh differentiator in how a man's going to be you know whether you have a kid whether y'all have a family together be with men that want to be with you i ain't say you go date a lane but choose men who want to be with you you're more likely to get a successful outcome in a two-parent household when you go choose those kind of guys stop lining up to go be with men that's gonna do you just the hot same way he did all the other girls that's just the facts and to any dude out there man listen because some of these girls out here is for the streets they community property man and some of these girls be having sex with multiple guys man in a week span some girls have sex with multiple guys in a day you know she got two three other guys busting her raw then you doing the same thing make sure you wear protection man and she get pregnant you do not have no power bro it's on her and so we'll say in certain states depending on what states you in you know you know, but that's it, y'all. Listen, man, before I leave out of here, man, get your money on point, get your mind on point, get your body on point. You know what I'm saying? And then last but not least, man, get you a passport, man. Travel, man. Because once you see it, you can't unsee it. Like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, then tell a friend, then tell another friend. Listen, I'll see y'all in the next video. I'm out. Yeah. Got the streets on fire, feel the heat, the wane, way. Ain't never had no handouts, put in work, I'm self made. Superhero strength, I got the power, Luke Cage. Flexing on them haters like Drake.